and now go along into BHS, which are famous for having old Otis's, and it's been modernised by 21st century lips. Bloody hell. And now along to another little hydraulic shindle lift, which is more of a Keithley lift really. Doors closing. Level 2. Doors opening. Doors closing. Level 1. Doors opening. And now go along into WH Smiths and the Shinder lift there has been modernised. Doors closing. Torn and done woody key lifts. Yeah, they had to change the name to PDRS. Imagine if they kept their name as Porn and Done Woody. Doors open, going down. Now along into clocks where there is a nice 80s stanner. Doors closing. Doors opening. Right then, we're now going to the shop which used to be JJB Sports. It's now HMV, and this shop used to have a completely original 1960s single speed express lift. This lift was completely awesome, and they've now gone and modernised it. I'm not happy, this lift was a completely visual. It's like this is such an awesome old express, and they've just ruined it. But on the plus side, at least we can now see what's up on the top floor.
now, we now go into the awesome Orders department store. Now, this place has not changed in years. It's like a just complete surviving timepiece. It's like walking into this shop. It's like going back in time to the 1960s, back to what department stores used to be like. It literally has not changed in years. It is so awesome. So then, this used to be Orders flag flagship shop. That's a tongue twister. Flagship shop. And then Orders expanded throughout the UK many years ago. And Orders like is big chain of department stores. A few years ago, Orders went bankrupt and all their shops disappeared throughout the UK, all being turned into either Debenhams or House of Fraser, and the administrators kept on this one shop since it was still profitable. Then a few years later, this shop then went bankrupt for the second time, and everyone thought that John Lewis would come and take over the shop since Croydon's a really big place, everyone thought John Lewis would love this place, but they didn't, which is actually a really good thing, as this shop's now been turned into a village for outlet furniture shop thing, is very run down, but everything in it is kept original. 